BRICS is an alliance which represents Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa. The number of BRICS countries has now reached 10. It's a huge development. BRICS has annual summit, and this year, Russia has hosted the 16th annual summit of BRICS. Leaders of various countries and international organizations, including Ethiopian Prime Minister, His Excellency Dr. Abiy Ahmed, have attended the three-day summit which was held in the city of Kazan, Russia. Hello and welcome. My guest for today is Russian Ambassador to Ethiopia, Yevgeny Terihon. Ambassador, thank you very much for your time and collaboration. As Russian Ambassador to Ethiopia, uh, I believe you have been closely watching uh, Ethiopia's involvement and participation in BRICS. Uh, so from your vantage point, uh, what benefits could Ethiopia secure from BRICS uh, and what it can contribute for the success of uh, BRICS objective? Well, uh, first of all, uh, I would like to stress that Ethiopia's accession to BRICS uh, is an important step and an our confirmation of your country's high authority in the international arena. I would like to take this opportunity to once again congratulate our dear Ethiopian uh, friends on joining BRICS and thank them uh, all for their constructive cooperation uh, within the framework of this association. Uh, personally, I should express uh, my feelings, you see, it is rather difficult to, exp to express feelings, but really uh, the enthusiasm with which Ethiopian side uh, uh, started its uh, activities within the framework of BRICS is really amazing and inspiring. Uh, for instance, uh, this year during the Russian chairmanship, uh, we were conducting, we, were, we have planned to conduct around uh, 240 or 50 different events uh, within framework, uh, BRICS framework in our country. And uh, by now, uh, I suppose uh, at least in 19 of, these main of the main events, Ethiopian side has actively participated. And uh, it is really a great, great result. I believe that Ethiopia's participation in BRICS uh, gives the association an additional solid weight, allows it to significantly expand its uh, interaction with the countries of the continent, promotes the dissemination uh, of ideas and practices of uh, BRICS uh, at the pan-African and uh, regional levels, including on the basis of specific examples of uh, Ethiopia's uh, uh, concrete work within the association. Uh, we observed uh, numerous uh, tremendous bilateral talks uh, which were conducted on the sidelines of uh, BRICS summit. Uh, so my question is uh, how BRICS uh, is bolstering uh, trade, economic and diplomatic relations uh, between and among member states of BRICS? Uh, on the economic track, uh, the Russian BRICS uh, chairmanship uh, uh, is placing special emphasis uh, on further strengthening cooperation between uh, the BRICS member states in trade, investment, uh, innovation, technology and social spheres, ensuring energy and food security, enhancing the role of BRICS in the international monetary and financial system and uh, developing interbank uh, cooperation. Uh, in the case of our country, for example, its uh, total trade turnover with the BRICS uh, countries increased by almost 28% uh, during 2023, that is uh, even uh, before the BRICS expansion. And uh, the total uh, trade with the BRICS countries uh, during this year, during the first five months of this year, uh, have already increased by 6.3%. Uh, uh, our common goal is uh, to create conditions for strong economic growth of all BRICS countries. Apparently, uh, BRICS has been established with the notion that uh, the current global order is not uh, serving uh, the world fairly and in equal manner. Uh, so what we should expect from BRICS 
uh, in terms of changing uh, this global order? Uh, very interesting question, uh, honestly speaking. Uh, I'm confident that the weight and the role of uh, BRICS on the world stage will only grow. Uh, in the course of our interview, I have touched upon uh, uh, the principles that underpin the activities of BRICS. In uh, recent years, we have witnessed uh, these principles being con confidently put into practice and becoming more and more attractive uh, to the countries of the global majority. I believe that this process uh, will only gain momentum in the future and uh, will uh, allow all of us uh, to build interstate relations on a more balanced, uh, fair and mutually beneficial basis. Uh, speaking long uh, things short, uh, I am confident that BRICS is the new reality of our modern world and uh, its role will be enhanced and be, will be widened uh, from day to day. And I am happy that uh, our Ethiopian friends are among these countries who are now acting as the leading, as the moving mechanism of the development of the whole mankind. Ambassador, thank you very much for sharing your thoughts and insights regarding this year's BRICS summit, which was held in the city of Kazan, Russia. I thank you very much for your time, and I hope I will see you in another show. Thank you very much. I am absolutely sure that we'll meet very soon.